Hello everyone, Matthew here. Now, if you can see that there is a station module 267 from Gold Planet, it's because, well, I had a bit of a problem. I tried to launch a rocket that was carrying uh, some modules to YT1. This was going to be the third part, um, but unfortunately... I kind of ran out of fuel, so I had to send another module, and that ran out of fuel, so then I had to send another module, and that ran out of fuel, and it ended, the file of the video ended up being too long, and it stopped recording, so, I'm going to use, I know you're going to kill me for saying this, a quick launch, I'm only going to use it for this episode, but because I'm so tired, and I'm just, i I can't do it anymore, so I'm just gonna have to do a quick launch. It'll probably only be like two minutes long. I'm sorry, this was. I'm sorry, episode three was a bit long. I'll try and make episode th uh, episode four much better. Um, but uh, yeah. Anyway, let's get on with the video. Well, the first thing we're gonna launch is a medical bay. Yeah, medical bay. So. Let's launch. Now, why do you want us a bit of a problem? Oh, never mind. Well, in our um, endeavor to rescue YT1, um, I, I, the battery just, like, the battery of the station just um, tried to die on me so I'm gonna put on the end of the oxygen module a like a temporary um, solar pan solar panel array uh, just to generate a little bit of power because we need it um, because else this craft will literally die um, on us because uh, the only thing that's really supplying power at the moment is the, uh, the tug um, and that's got like Literally only look a back one battery in it and it's better to run out. So we've gotta deliver by a quick launch a um a soul panel. There we go. Brain keeps stop working. Um right. Brain keeps stop no oh god, I can't I can't pardon me. I can't speak. I'll just stop speaking so that I don't mess anything up. Um anyway, so we're almost docked. I just remembered we don't need a medical bay. I already launched one. Um, as long as we can have two. It doesn't really matter. I wasn't really going to use this for anything anyway. Um, Right, I think we might have a standard module on the end of the thingy one, just so it's balanced, because if it's not balanced and perfect, I cannot have it, I cannot, it cannot exist, it cannot exist, it's very atoms, cannot be, cannot be, it's very atoms, cannot be, so, we're going to put another uh, module, just a standard module, normal one, uh, off with YT1. There we go, uh, back. Just notice we're not straight, so I'll just straighten myself up. And go across. Just adopt this module. All the modules are the same size. Um, we'll just be using different modules, I guess. So we'll have the oxygen, normal storage module. Two medical modules, uh, and on the each a temporary solar panel before we get the big main ones in uh, in episode. I imagine four, episode four. Payload released. So uh, yeah, let's get the solar panels on. So we're going to be using the um, the large ones just because I want to, <laughs> and um, yeah, let's uh, let's use the large ones. Shh. 
So because this is a really small tug for some reason, I mean it's the smallest. They, with quick launches, they tend to use the smallest possible module uh, with the least fuel. So uh, yeah, we're just going to be very conservative with uh, how much wh where we where we go, how much fuel we use uh, with, with these modules. We're going to be docking too. But uh, yeah, so let's uh, stop ourselves before we smack right into the station. And go across. And go forward and dock. Payload released. And then we'll do another one uh, on the other side. And, um, yeah, so, what to talk about, never really think of what to talk about, just normally very fast, but with these, with me needing to be conservative with these tiny little tugs, I, uh, I should be very slow and, uh, and can't think of what to talk about, really, uh, but we are nearing the docking port, and, um, I have something to talk about, actually, um, you see Kerbal Space Program. Um, I'll be doing series on that, but I don't have the necessary equipment, uh, aka a camera. What's it? Um, so yeah, I'll do that probably when I have a camera or something to record Kerbal Space Program with. But um, comment down below once I do that what you would want to see on Kerbal Space Program. If you so do want to see Kerbal Space Program, probably go off and watch someone like Matt Lowell or something. Um, but if you want to see me do it, then uh, you can always comment down below what you want to see. And uh, as I said, I will deliver. Speed this up. Oh, no, that's the wrong way. <laughs> Then we're gonna be three, two, one, one, and one, and then we'll fast forward. And duck. Payload released. Right now, let's get the solar panels up and functioning. Right now, this is where this thing really starts. These solar panels are incredibly efficient. They generate, they use two and generate 100. Well, they only supply 98. Mainly because they're using their own power. Uh, but, yeah, so uh, that was episode three of my Building the Space Station series. As always, subscribe to Pete's King, which is Aaron's channel, Mr. Biscuit, which is my channel, and Gaming United MA, which is me and Aaron's channel. And uh, don't forget to like, uh, subscribe, um, hit the bell, um, and comment, of course, if you want to, of course. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.